Well, less than 10 days to go now before Christmas. If you're a last minute shopper, you could end up spending more than you can really afford. Two News reporter Krista Flash shows how to avoid racking up holiday debt in tonight's segment two. Sales, sales, and more sales. Retailers are slashing prices in an effort to woo shoppers into stores. But experts say, watch out. Impulse buying, impulse shopping is one of the most dangerous things we can do. Certified public accountant Jeff Frabel recommends making a list. It's the best defense against impulse buying. Uh, if we don't have a shopping list for Christmas, we end up buying more than we need to buy. It makes you feel bad for going over, but in a way, it's a giving time so I feel like the more you give the more you're going to get back anyway. Many of us feel that way during the holidays but Frable warns don't let your emotions get you into financial trouble. So set a budget and if you use a credit card make sure you pay it off at the end of the billing cycle otherwise. You might have spent $25 for someone and thought that was a, a very small gift and if you tack interest and credit and charges on top of that, it could end up costing $30, $40 easily. Frable also suggests bargain hunting. My husband's keeping me in check. <laughs> and I'm taking advantage of coupons and, you know, online coupons and in the mail coupons and sales. Savings that make it easier to be just as generous as Santa. Krista Flash, 2 News works for you. One financial expert has even tailored specific tips based on a shopper's personality. You'll find it on our website, kgrh.com. Just click on News and then Segment 2.